Tea in the RV, how very civil. Hi guys, we just actually stopped off, really just come outside uh, Ockley and we found this lovely, lovely old church and we just quickly stopped and have a quick look. ES 1700, can you see that? William Butler, Send 1700. It's the Church of St Margaret. Uh, I think it looks very ancient. This is looking probably late, probably Norman fixtures. Early 13th, 14th century probably. We're just saying this stonework is probably much newer, I would think. Um, that's great for a lovely setting. It's a shame we can't get in. But, you know, some of these country churches do leave their um, doors unlocked. Not in the cities or the towns. Yeah, it's nice. Lovely blue sky today. Quick look around the, uh, the graveyard. This is interesting. It's like a family plot and the gate's actually open. It's quite nice. Any ideas? And it, it's old stuff, isn't it? It's yeah. not 1700s. It could be people, the builders or the architects. I don't know. William Butler, I thought it was William Shatner, but William Butner sends 1700, yeah. I'm guessing it's someone who made the church. Let's well, say if people do know, please let us know. It's all got sun in, in my eyes. Um, Foundation stone, yeah, could be. Mm. This is laid this, laid this stone, stone on the Alfred stone, something and so MI seventeen hundred on this. So it could be a foundation stone. Or yeah, I think they're like. I think it's the people that actually built the church, the stonemasons or whatever, and yeah. I think they've they've put their name on it. That's what it is. That's what it looks like, isn't it? Yeah. I think we've answered our own question there. If anyone has got any more information on that, please let us know. It's very interesting. So it's just a quick trip around St Margaret's, a very, very quick trip. We just saw it on the way and we thought, let's go and have a quick look. Forgive the uh, airplane, we're very, very near Gatwick Airport. We're at St John the Baptist Church in um, Capel, in deepest Surrey, in the Surrey Hills. And uh, look at this, look at this lovely old tree. Straight away as we walked in. All fenced off, it's all, oh yeah, it's a very, I think it's a dead tree by the looks of it. Oh yeah, the metal ones we saw over in, um, West Hoadley, wasn't it? Yeah. These metal graves, gravestones. That's a nice one. Now we don't know much about this church, we just come up, we saw it, we thought we were gonna go and have a look, because we do like these old churches. So we've come in the church. I love a very welcoming notice outside saying, please come in our church. If there was a service on, please, you know, come in quietly, which is lovely. We like it when it's very um, welcoming. Mm. Very nice. It's a staircase. Oh, wow, look at this. Going up to the built tower. said before in these old villages you know, the church was the hub of the community and we should uh, keep
keep them going. This one is obviously still in use quite a lot. You can do it very active. There's lots of um, things around to say that like, this is probably used a lot uh, during the year. Okay, this drain pipe is 1865. Yeah. Oh, 1865. So, which was a really long time ago. Yes, 100. And, Oh gosh, 160 something years. So just another quick look around uh, this church. So we do love our churches, absolutely love them. Okay, we're now in Newdigate in deepest Surrey. And we're, <laughs> this vlog now has become three churches in the Surrey Hills. Because that's what we visited, three churches in the Surrey Hills. So we're here now at St Peter's Church in Newdigate. Uh, lovely little village. We'll have a quick look around. Let's go. Thank you. Once again, I don't know how old this is. Oh, it says actually it was founded in the 12th century. I think there must have been an earlier church on the site. Church is just opposite the Six Bells pub. Yep, yeah, it's another small door. I know me and doors. That is, yeah. So here's a top, and that's me. Okay, let's see if open. See, yeah, with bell ringers. Never seen it like that before. Yeah. Just talking to somebody who uh, works here, and uh, yes, it, the original church was built in 1175. 1175. Wow. This is interesting. This parish church of St. Peter was restored, and the new. Th the North Isle added AD 1877. So this was uh, originally struck with 1175. <laughs> We're looking at the little rivets and the original nails used because I said some of this panning was quite new. Maybe some of it was replaced. This is like 1500s, so the uh, chap was telling us. But yeah, so there's some new nails here you can see, but a lot of them the originals. Yeah. So look, this whole, whole thing has been done yeah. with new nails, but the ones that are above and below are. The old nails. Well, thanks very much, guys, for joining us. Uh, three churches in the Surrey Hills. There's plenty more of them to explore. Thanks to Al and Ellie for joining me. I uh, hope you've enjoyed it. If you've liked what you've seen, please like, subscribe. Uh, please leave a comment if you've got any more additional history information, which is always useful to know. And we'll see you next time. Be seeing you.